Hello folks, this is Jacob Butler with Bloom Gardens here in Terre Haute, Indiana. Uh, we just got done laying our second bale garden uh, over here at Indiana State University's Community Garden. I just wanted to uh, give a demonstration on how to do a no-till system uh, while incorporating mushrooms at, to help decompose the bales and all the other uh, litter that I've put on top of it. Uh, you can see here the soil is just basic urban soil, rocky, a lot of weeds, a lot of clay, a lot of sand. Not really good to grow in and I don't really want to till it up. Uh, very well could be somewhat contaminated so we're just going to build soil on top. So what we've got, uh, we're lucky enough to have quite a bit of compost here and uh, some all this grass. This uh, decorative grass is, was cut and in a pile so I could use it. Uh, Going to plant some corn, probably in the three sister style with some uh, peas or beans and then some squash coming out of them. Uh, these little bales here is a good example of just doing one bale. Uh, I'm probably going to plant either some peppers or something in those. Uh, <laughs> I got my little mushroom guy over here. Uh, this bin over here was uh, spawned with king oyster mushroom. Uh, this one was spawned with king stropharia or the garden giant. And this one was spawned with pearl oysters. Uh, I'll be doing a trellis in between that walkway where the king stropharia's are. Uh, a, kind of a dome trellis and uh, sort of the toma small tomatoes like cherry tomatoes and stuff to grow, to grow up. Um, not sure what we'll do in the middle rows yet. Still kind of planning on what we're going to plant, but that's it. So uh, stay tuned and see how it grows out.